A 65-year-old male presented with dysphagia, adenophagia, and hematemesis. His past medical history was remarkable for chronic renal failure, atherosclerosis, and pemphigoid. On skin examination, there were several red patches and small fluid-filled blebs on both hands and feet. His hemoglobin was decreased and the C-reactive protein was markedly elevated. Esophagogastroduodenoscopy EGD, disclosed an erythematous and edematous esophageal mucosa with two bloody, fluid-filled blebs. More blebs developed upon endoscopic contact with the esophageal mucosa. Biopsies of one of these lesions resulted in peeling off of the mucosa. Histology revealed squamous epithelial detachment from the submucosal layers. There was clear dilation of the intercellular spaces, as shown in the periodic acid shift PAS stain. This patient suffered from esophageal involvement from bullous pemphigoid type 2, as demonstrated later by the presence of antibodies against the 180 KDA basement membrane antigen. There are many autoimmune skin disorders that also affect the esophagus, including bullous pemphigoid, pemphigus vulgaris, cicatricial pemphigoid, epidermolysis bullosa acquisita, and lichen planus pemphigoides. Non-autoimmune diseases presenting with vesicles, bullae, or exfoliative esophagitis include herpes simplex virus, lichen planus, amyloidosis, eosinophilic esophagitis, graft-versus-host disease, reactions to blood transfusion, Bessette's disease, radiation esophagitis, and esophagitis dissecans superficialis.